Okay, I'm going to change my mind. I'm going to go with that. So for the first time, what card were you focusing on? Three of Dimes. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Great, yeah. And the card I was trying to send you was the Nine of Hearts. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Excellent, two yeah. For two. Brilliant. Yeah. Okay. And I'll be honest with you, my bank pin number, it, the last two digits are actually the same. So whatever number you just wrote down, write the same number again and put it face down. So this was just using your intuition. So we'll see how close you got, right? So my bank pin number genuinely is a 4622. How close do you get? Spot on. Great. 4622. <laughs> cool. So don't steal my card now. <laughs> I'll go down the pub with your bank card. Great. Cool. So I'm going to look away in a moment. And all I want you to do, you know how to shuffle a deck of cards, right? You're just going to take about half from the back, shuffle on top like this. Remember whatever card you shuffle to the face and then do the same thing again. I'm going to be looking away and at the end, if you want to, you can spread through and just cut the deck. So do this face up so the cards are facing you. So sh shuffle to the face, remember whatever card is on the face. And then give them another shuffle and a cut at the end if you want. Yeah. Okay, so just place the deck down. So right now, there should be nowhere on earth I could get this, right? I was looking away, you shuffled, you just thought of a card as you were shuffling, and you even shuffled again and then cut the deck. So if I get this, it should be quite good. Yeah. So just focus on the card. Just imagine the colour for me, okay? So this is red, yeah? I know this sounds odd, but just open your mouth slightly, and just in your mind only, just imagine saying the suit. Just repeat it over and over. So it's a heart. Yeah. yeah. So now imagine the entire card just painted brightly and vividly in front of you. I think I've got this. So for the first time, just say out loud the card that you just thought of as a Jewish shuffle. The Nine of Hearts. Good. Great. <laughs> there we go. So you can uh, be happy they're mixed. Good? Yep. I'm going to turn away, and when I turn away, I want you to just cut the cards any way you like, and I want you to look at the card you've cut to. So make sure I can't see. And you've got one, you can remember that? Yep. And now I want you to give them a quick shuffle. Mm-hmm. No, the whole thing, all the cards together. Oh, okay. Yep. Happy I couldn't know your card or location of any no. of the cards in there. No, not at all. Um, I just want you to concentrate on your card. Okay. First of all, I want you to concentrate on the colour. Yep. This is a black card, isn't it? Yep. And it's... It's a club. Yep. <laughs> Fairly high one... Is it? No, it's not a picture card, it's a number card. It's a nine. Nine of clubs. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Great. Like it? Really cool. So just get into a rapport of doing this. Just start dealing one at a time face down. And wherever you get a feeling to stop, just stop. Happy there? there? Yeah. Okay, you can put the deck over there. So be honest with me, did you count these at all? No. Good. Because this would be a conscious consideration. So this was more about your feelings as opposed to anything conscious. But just out of interest, we'll, we'll see how many you counted. So at fingertip fairness, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And I'm not even going to touch that. So just have a look at what I wrote as a prediction. Queen of Diamonds. Queen of Diamonds? Yeah. So would it be impressive if the card you dealt to matched the prediction? There we go. Great. Cool. That's cool. It's really cool.